Well, hello! And how yous doing? Oh, blood bike. Uh, so, riding in the winter, here we are. It's dry. Well, no, it's not dry. It's warmish. It's not freezing. It has been raining. But because we've had uh, freezing weather as well, there's been grit on the roads and even when the roads are dry the residue of the grit you're picking up on your wheels and you're flinging it all over your bike so top tip and i know this from experience is uh when you've finished being out in a ride whether it's been completely dry or you've been through wet patches rinse off your uh your bike with you know just with a hose pipe just with clean water before putting it to bed I never used to be able to do that because my bike lived in the front garden and we didn't have a hose pipe. So uh, all through winter my bike would be picking up all the crud, all the salt shit. And what happens is, especially around your brakes, um, it goes in by the where the pistons are and as it dries it just fucking solidifies into this like concrete crap and it causes your pistons to your brake pistons to stick and uh, reduces your your braking power and also a problem that I had specifically was when there was any moisture in there I'd park my bike up and I'd go <laughs> go back to it and the moisture in the air would cause the salt crud to expand pushing my uh, cylinders out more which would mean that my brakes would be on so I'd have to rock the bike back and forth to to free them up before I could even do anything so I'm gonna head back when I get home now I'm gonna crack out the hose pipe and uh, just give the, the bottom half of the bike a quick a quick rinse just to get the the salt off um, I got two more weeks on my placement and then I'm going to be doing a brake overhaul because I know that my brakes are, especially my front, I can feel that they're not operating as they should do. I'm pulling in the, um, pulling in the brake lever, pulling in, pulling in, and then I feel, I can actually feel the brake piston come out. Um, and that's not the way it should be so I've got to take them out I'm probably going to be uh, scraping all this uh, this grit out of there because I haven't done it for a while so I'll do a video on that in the meantime if you want to see how it's done check out um, you know, Moonfleet 41 Del Boy's Garage because he talks about it in one of his videos and shows it to being done So let's go home and let's go home and have a shower. There we are. That was no good. This one. Better. Another problem with salt is it ruins the uh, finish on your paintwork on your wheels. As you can see on my front wheel.
There we are. And that'll do us.